I think some people are still having trouble with the drawer <clears throat> and menu items and paper um, that's part of at least one of our assignments. The week 10 Firebase React assignment. So let's, I've put together up in JS objects in the um, JavaScript's React directory a new project called Drawer Menu. It's a Create React app. And I'll go ahead and start it. And it pops up and it gives that sort of basic interface that I think you've seen before. And um, if you click on it, it will pop open a drawer. And if you click on the drawer, it'll insert two, one of two React components inside the paper. So uh, let's take a look at this one for a second. First, here are the two components that get inserted. Here's the foo component, which renders you picked foo. Here's the bar component, which renders you picked bar. Then um, index.js is just very basic here. We bring in the MUI theme provider. Um, we bring in Material UI, you need to do an NPM install, of course, for Material UI. And Material UI had a breaking change as we moved from 19.4 to 2.0, which happened within the last maybe even hours or certainly within the last couple days. And um, the change is found here. On left icon button used to be click, used to be called on left icon button touch tap and they've changed it to click. And so um, <clears throat> if you're using 19.4, you would use on left icon button touch tap. If you're using 2.0, if you're using 0 19.4, then you should go with touch tap. If you're using 2.0.0, then you should go with click. OK. So I just wanted to say that before I forgot. So up at the top, we bring in foo, we bring in bar, we bring in the app bar, we bring in the drawer, we bring in the menu, we bring in paper. Um, then we're creating two bits of state here. One, which is whether the drawer is open or closed, and the other is what component to show inside the paper. So down here, um, <clears throat> we make up our mind which type of content we want to show in the paper. Do we want to show foo? Do we want to show bar? Or do we just say that we're waiting for the user to do something? And we plop down that con content right here in the paper. So the paper will either have foo or bar in it, depending on whether content is set to foo or bar. In order to choose foo or bar, <clears throat> in our drawer we have two menu items. And when you click on one, you get show foo. And when you click on the other, you get show bar. And um, <clears throat> show bar sets the state of show to bar. So show gets set to bar. And then if show is set to bar, then the content gets set to bar. <clears throat> and if show is set to foo, then the content is set to foo. So we have two set states setting bar setting show to either bar or few, and in both cases <clears throat> we close the drawer by setting open to false. And this will toggle this on left icon button click, which is the one I said changed from on left icon button touch tap to on left icon button click, now calls toggle handle toggle, which means that things can get toggled back and forth when you click on this button. And I guess it always closes it since we can't toggle it. We can't hit it again. OK, so that's what I wanted to show you right there. Um, let me just go through it again to make sure we're getting it. Here's where we declare the app bar. The app bar is this thing up here. Here's where we declare the paper. The paper is this thing here. And this is the drawer here. And the drawer is declared here. And in the drawer, we put two menus item, one saying show foo 
and one saying show bar. Okay, so hopefully everybody will be able to at least get the interface together for this, um, both for the final and for the show react state with this to work with. And remember, it's just sitting up there. You just need to do a poll on <clears throat> JS objects and then in the git JS objects JavaScript react drawer menu um, directory you will find this project right okay thanks now